Toffler. The chief of the El Paso Police Department, who had been in the, at the helm for 15 years, was laid to rest today. Chief Greg Allen died last Tuesday after he had undergone a medical procedure and was recovering. ABC 7's Rosemary Montanez was at the funeral and burial. She has the sights and sounds. This was a place where El Paso Police Chief Greg Allen was laid to rest after he was with the police department for more than 44 years. Friends, family and colleagues lining this empty field to say goodbye to him one last time. This was a scene Friday afternoon as law enforcement officers waited for the moment where late El Paso Police Chief Greg Allen would arrive at his final resting place. The men and women he once led now leading the way to his gravesite. It was a somber day for loved ones as bagpipes played. Two officers slowly preparing the flag that would be given to Chief Allen's wife as hundreds more stood and watched. One officer handing that flag to Roseanne Allen. The tributes also coming from above. And finally, the Allen family releasing white doves. Robert Almonte was once the deputy chief at the El Paso Police Department. He says Allen cared about people and he'll miss his sense of humor. Great friend and, and, and it, it, it hurt. This is a dark day for uh, for El Paso. We, we, lost, we truly lost a hero, hero and you can see by the overwhelming turnout of people participating that came to say goodbye. Uh, he was well loved. This was his last radio call. Many saying Chief Allen's legacy will live on. For now reporting in the east side, Rosemary Montañez, ABC 7.